Yo, what's going on guys? It's React here and today I'm bringing you a new video and in this video we're going to be talking about is Call of Duty dying? Now, in my opinion, Infinite Warfare is the, the worst Call of Duty game ever made and if I'm talking a bit quiet guys, it's because um, I forgot that I'm supposed to make a video today and it is exactly 12.18 in the morning so that's very very exciting it's a lot of fun but you know i am always on the grind trying to bring a video to you guys but that's not the point anyways back to the point infinite warfare being the worst call of duty ever i i dude i played it for the first two weeks and then just gave up on it i was what's the max level i think the max level is 55 i made it to prestige one level 53 almost prestige two didn't quite make it but that's whatever i just don't like that game that game just i don't know dude it's the, the skill gap is basically non-existent. It's whoever looks at each other first and aims down sights first and shoots first. It's basically shoot first, get the kill. It should be like that in every Call of Duty, but... Dude, the kill time is just inexcusable. It's probably faster than Ghost. Especially the fact that they make the guns four shots to kill like they did in Black Ops 3. But for some reason, the hit detection is like... The hit detection is so good that it bites them in the ass and it messes them up and the kill time is really fast. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Do you guys still play Infinite Warfare? I don't at all. What you guys are seeing in the background is a Modern Warfare remaster gameplay. I got that gameplay probably in the first week of, you know, the games releasing. But whatever. Is Call of Duty dying? That is the whole, like, that's the bullet point. And to be honest... Judging by the sales and whatnot, judging by the reviews, every year it's getting worse. I don't know if it's considered dying, but it's its interest is diminishing slowly. And especially with Infinite Warfare being such a garbage game, I mean, like a lot of YouTubers don't even play it no more, including me. I don't play it no more. I don't record it anymore. I don't talk about it. No one, none of my friends at school actually play that game, and. A lot of the pro players, I don't know if you guys keep up with like MLG, UMG and whatnot, competitive Call of Duty. Those guys have nothing but bad things to say about the game all the time. Like a lot of players are going back to Black Ops 3. And some, you know, YouTube pump stompers and whatnot are going back to old, even older Call of Duties. And I might as well, you know. Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered is obviously fun and all, but obviously older Call of Duties having the experience that I've already had in those games is going to be great to go back and play those games because they're actually fun like Infinite Warfare makes me cry and every time I go on Instagram or Twitter and see Infinity Ward tweet like a little thing saying hey we got this coming to the game and this and whatnot and I'm just thinking to myself where are the combat records and leaderboards I don't you add 40 camos and not leaderboards and whatnot. I'm, this is not a bash video on Infinite Warfare. I'm going to stop right there. Call of Duty, is it dying? No. I don't think so. It's it's diminishing. Like I said before, its interest is diminishing. Especially with a lot of people, like casual players. Like people that don't even, you know, watch YouTube or, you know, play the game like every single day. Like people that play like on the weekends or whatnot, they don't even like the game the sales prove it you know it's not sell it hasn't sold that much and if it wasn't for modern warfare remaster if it wasn't for modern warfare remaster it would have sold even less i'm pretty sure because you know i would have bought the game regardless but i purchased the legacy edition so i could get both games and dang dude okay i can't believe i said dang dude but you know it's supposed to be 60 dollars for infinity infinity infinite warfare and twenty dollars extra for a modern warfare remastered i feel like it's the other way around sixty dollars for a modern warfare remastered and twenty dollars for infinite warfare that game like oh my god i keep going back to that game i can't it's call of duty dying basically i'm gonna give you guys some points you guys judge on yourself you know sales are down content views are down nobody likes the game casuals don't even like the game competitive players don't like the game and they, Infinity War, don't even fix, you know, the problems with their games. And hopefully Sledgehammer revives the Call of Duty series. It's pretty much all but confirmed at this point that the next Call of Duty game, called Call of Duty 2017, will be boots on the ground. I'm 99% sure that it's true that the next Call of Duty will be boots on the ground. And it will be made by Sledgehammer, obviously. I hope that they bring 
like some sort of you know modern era or even past era i like battlefield one you guys seen it i like it it's a lot of fun modern yes you know back in the past sure future no dude four yeah, no okay hold on modern warfare 3 was modern black ops 2 was futuristic but not like over the top ghosts was futuristic but not over the top in advanced warfare holy shit i'm not even gonna talk about that black ops 3 that was futuristic but a little chilled with the movement i don't know dude you guys let me know in the comments below what you guys think thank you guys so much for watching sorry it was a short video but i am crunching on time right now i need my sleep so i could get up tomorrow and upload this video i also need to get it edited but thank you guys so much for watching again and i'll see you guys in the next video